Having a hard time creating consistent AI characters, this AI tool makes it easier than ever. In this tutorial, I'll show you exactly how to use design to create characters that stay consistent across every scene. You'll learn two powerful techniques to get pro-level results. First, we'll explore how to use a seed number to keep your characters consistent. Then, I'll show you how to train the AI model for effortless consistent character creation. Okay, so click the link in the description to head over to the website. Once there, log into your account or sign up if you don't have one. Once logged in, click on New Project to get started. Select the Aspect Ratio. I recommend 16 by 9 to get more space to work with and click Apply. Now, the first way to create consistent characters is with the text to image tool. Here we will need a highly descriptive character prompt and more importantly, we will need to use a seed number. The seed number is what lets the AI maintain character consistency across different scenes. So let's use ChatGPT to generate our character prompt and a seed number. On the new tab, go to ChatGPT and log into your account or sign up if you don't have one. Once logged in, click on the new chat button and type in this prompt. You can copy and paste this prompt from the description of this video. Change this if you need a female character and give it an age. ChatGPT will generate something like this. As you can see, we get a highly descriptive prompt and a nine digit seed number. Now ask ChatGPT to clean up the prompt by typing this in. And ChatGPT will give us the prompts like this. Copy the first prompt and head back to design. And paste the prompt here. Instead of having the seed number here, we will copy it, go to advanced and paste it here. You can also pick one of the many styles available. I'll use this one since we already have a style in the prompt. Now, with the prompt and seed number set, click generate. In a few seconds, our character will be generated. And as you can see, we have our initial character. Now go back to ChatGPT. Copy the second prompt. We don't need the seed. And go back to design. Paste the prompt. And click generate. And as you can see, we have another scene of our character. Repeat this process for all the scenes you need. And simply, Click the download button to download the ones that you like. And that's it. That's how easy it is to create consistent characters using the seed number method. The second and best way to create consistent characters with this tool is by training the AI model. To do this, we use the character tool on the sidebar. Here we have two tools, the consistent character tool and the character sheet tool. We'll use the consistent character tool to train the AI model on our character by creating a preset with multiple images of our character in various poses. To create these images, we use the character sheet tool. So click on the character sheet tool, click here to choose a style for your character. For the prompt, you need to include the following to get the best results. The character name, age and gender, hairstyle, the face description, and the outfit. Since we already created our character prompt with ChatGPT, we simply need to copy the character description and paste it here. Sometimes it will generate character sheets with only three poses. So let's ask it to generate at least four different poses and click generate. In a few seconds, our character sheet will be created. As you can see, we get two variations. Now, we have to enhance and upscale it. So decide which one you like and click on its corresponding number next to enhance and upscale. First, we are going to enhance it. Click on portrait to enhance our character's facial features. Click on standard strength and click enhance. In a few seconds, our image will be enhanced and our character will look much sharper. Next, we have to download each of the images in our character sheet individually. To do this, double click on the character sheet to add it to the canvas. Click on layers. 
duplicate this layer for as many images as are in your character sheet. I'll duplicate it four times because there are four images in this character sheet. Then choose the first layer, click crop, drag the crop box to crop the first image, and click done. As you can see, this layer only has the first image of our character sheet. Do the same for each of the layers. Then click on these three dots. Click on Save Image As. Choose Upscale 2x. You can upscale it higher, but 2x is fine. And click Upscale. The image will be upscaled and downloaded to your computer. Go back to Layers and do the same for each of the other images. Once you have all the images of your character downloaded, the next step is to train the consistent character model. To do this, Go back to the character tool on the left sidebar, click on consistent character, and click on new character. Type in your character's name, and upload each of the character images here. And click train. This process can take over an hour, so let's come back when it's done. Once it's done, select your train character, the AI will already have a default description for the character. And in this box, we describe the action and the scene. Let's go back to ChatGPT and copy one of the action that it gave us earlier. So here we have this action and scene. Let's copy it. And paste it here. Choose the aspect ratio that you want. And click Generate. And in a few moments, the AI will generate a new scene featuring your character. As you can see, the character looks just like the ones in our character sheet and remains consistent across different scenes. Now, what if you want to change the outfit? To do this, we only need to change the outfit in the default description. Make sure that the outfit matches the action and the scene in order to get the best results when generating different scenes. So, let's change the outfit to something else. You can always restore the original default description by clicking this button. Let's change the action and scene as well. And click Generate. As you can see, we can completely change the outfit while maintaining character consistency. And that's it, that's all there is to it. Now, every time you need a new scene of your character, you only need to come here, type in the action and background, and generate away. Training your own AI model is currently the best way to create consistent AI characters and this AI tool makes it extremely easy to do. Give it a try yourself and see what you can create. If you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful, please show your support by hitting the thumbs up button, subscribing to our channel, and turning on the notifications bell so that you can keep up to date with new tutorials. Also leave your question and thoughts below. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.